so in chat GPT, we have a feature called study mode and in this particular mode ai is not giving you a straight answer instead it will break down the problem and will make sure that you understand the concept much better compared to if you're using just the regular version of chat GPT. And now Gemini just coming up with a new feature that is very similar called guided learning. Now, honestly, I'm kind of confused about why would Gemini do something like this because for the longest time, we have a feature called learning coach and it is actually being built using the gem feature from Gemini. And it is in some ways uh, trying to do the same as the study mode in ChatGPT. And as you mentioned yesterday, I have made a video on how you can copy the instruction from the study mode in ChatGPT and place it into Gemini via the gem feature and you'll get the same or similar experience to chat gpt uh, study mode but in gemini but now we have a brand new learning mode in chat gpt actually in gemini sorry about that in gemini called guided learning so to access this feature you can actually navigate to gemini.google.com and then you can click guided learning now for the mobile version so far i didn't see any option for that but I'm sure that that feature will eventually come for all users on all platforms for Gemini. But anyway, to use this, it's very simple. You can just enable that and then you can ask any question to Gemini. And in this case, I'll try to use this exact same questions that I tried on the study mode on ChatGPT. Explain to me why 0.99 infinitely equals to 1. And let's see what kind of answer that Gemini will give me in this particular format or particular mode. And as usual, it is a reasoning mode. So it's going to take quite a while to actually see the answer. But usually the quality is going to be much, much better than the regular AI mode. All right. So that's a classic and mind bending math question, etc. And then now what I like about the study mode, or in this case, the guided learning mode is that AI is not going to just give you the answer. It will actually ask you a question. So it is asking me back and it is trying to understand what is my level and what is my understanding about this particular problem or concept. So it is much better than the regular AI. Now, there is something here that I want to show you. And I think this feature, at least right now, is only available on Gemini Goddard Learning. So let's try creating a new chat. I'm going to click this and I'm going to use this as a prompt. Create 10 quiz about basic biology and then enable guided learning and send the message. Now, while still thinking and creating the answer, let's just use the same prompt to chat GPT and you'll see that Gemini has actually an edge when it comes to creating an interactive quiz. So ChatGPT will just give you a basic answer, and I mean text-based answer, which is fine, but it is not as good as this one from Gemini. So it is an interactive quiz that I could take, and not to mention, you can actually see the hint if you want to uh, easily recall your memory about that topic. And then you can select the answer, let's say here, I, I don't know, actually, I don't read the question. And then you can click next and then you can click, you know, the answer, click the answer. And finally, you can actually see the final score and you can choose whether you want to continue or you want to restart. So this is much better than this regular text based answer from the study mode in chat GPT. So go ahead to use the new guided learning in Gemini, because I think this feature is very useful for anyone that wants to learn anything, especially students. So thank you so much for watching and I'll see you on my next video. I wish you a great day ahead.